And wouldn't it be even greater if there was a way to advertise the university while doing this at the same time? Hi, my name is Regina Baderot, and um, I'm the business student here at St. Edwards University. I am an entrepreneurship major, actually, and I've taken that uh, major very seriously. And earlier this year, I co-founded a company called Inspire Vibe with um, my team, which consists of Ave Man Morris, who is the CEO, who came up with the idea, and our web developer, uh, Jared King. So today, I'm going to talk to you all about the advantages that would come from working with our company, which is you'd be getting great advertising for the university, you'd be uh, motivating the city as well as your students to volunteer in your community, you'd be helping one of your um, business students and uh, starting her career, and you'd be upholding the mission and principles of St. Edwards University. So I'd like to tell you all a little bit about Inspire Vibe. We basically just want to reward people who serve their community. Uh, we have a website, as you can see, on the board uh, where people can track and receive points for volunteering. They can also receive points for raising awareness on Facebook and Twitter. And the people with the most points um, are able to win free tickets to some of the coolest events in town, uh, such as like concerts and sporting events. So basically, we're just uh, giving people an incentive to go out and help their community. So you might be asking uh, how we pay for the ticket. Um, well, we are for profit, and we're actually a social media marketing company. And what we do is we work with other companies who care about their community, and they uh, we work with them, and they sponsor a set amount of tickets to an event. And they hold a competition on our website. So um, people can start uh, competing to get as many points for volunteering and raising awareness on their social media as possible. And in return, the companies who sponsor those tickets get exclusive marketing opportunities because uh, when we go out and tell, uh, spread the word about how you can get the tickets, um, all the university or uh, the company gets kind of the bragging rights. They're the ones who um, get, like, uh, well, for instance, like, we would have a tweet and it, it would say, if anyone loves volunteering like I do, St. Ed's is giving out free tickets, and then hashtag Inspire Vibe. And with that, we're able to track um, how many times people actually send a tweet and, uh, like, who's seeing those tweets. So uh, thanks to the social media and our advanced technology these days. And we think this is really great because uh, it's one of the best types of marketing there is, which is word of mouth. People are much uh, more likely to trust uh, what they hear from friends than what they see on a billboard. <coughs> so the company who sponsors a set amount of tickets basically gets uh, all of the recognition for making those available. So we believe that advertising is extremely powerful. The average Twitter user has about 230 followers. So if you had about 300 people who decided to compete in this competition, you would get about 69 people viewing that tweet um, just in one day. And we believe these numbers could be even higher just because of uh, the multiple times they can get points because they're open to get those points every day. And that's not even counting how many people would retweet the message or um, count how much Facebook recognition they would receive. And the great thing about this form of marketing is that it's not going to be something just seen here in Austin. It's going to be seen from all over the country. And potentially um, students here who tweet the message, it can be uh, seen by their friends who are still in high school back at home. And those people can recognize like what a cool university we are, uh, especially when considering where to go for college. So um, basically, since we are a startup, we're looking for someone to help us run our beta test, which basically means uh, we just want to get some uh, experience before working with bigger companies. So we would not charge for any advertising costs. It would just be the amount of money that the tickets would cost, depending on how much or how many tickets you would like to sponsor. 
but you would still get all of the same marketing uh, advantages. So uh, you might be saying why St. Edwards or a university were not exactly like um, a traditional company, but we think um, you all could really use our service because of the marketing uh, advantages you would get. Um, Basically, we think the city of Austin is a perfect place to start because of the culture here. People are so willing uh, to help their community and they can do it in any way they please. They can uh, help the environment, they can help animals, uh, the hungry, any way uh, they want. So it uh, is advertisable to all sorts of people. Um, so you would also be helping, uh, again, one of your business students here at St. Edwards. And the most important part, I believe, is that it'd be a great positive influence on your, not only your students, but the, uh, the people in the city of Austin as well. And that's because it upholds the mission and the principles of the school, especially um, our motto to take on our world because that's literally what these young people would be doing. So, um, we are asking um, for y'all to sponsor and to grab as much attention as possible. We think a good amount of tickets to sponsor would be around between 25 and 50 tickets, just so you get um, enough of the public to get uh, involved. And we think that those people would feel that they would have a better chance if there were more tickets available. And so if we do the math and tickets cost about $50, because it doesn't have to be the front row seat. Um, it can be like lawn seats to anything like Coldplay or um, Mumford and Sons. Um, so if you did sponsor 50 tickets and they cost $50, that'd be about $2,500. And if you decided to sponsor about 25 tickets and they cost 20, uh, $50, that'd be $1,250. And that would be the complete cost of the service because Again, it's just a beta test, so, um, but people from all over the country are still going to be able to hear about what a great university St. Edwards is. So, um, in conclusion, not only will you be getting advertising for the university, but you will also be supporting one of your young entrepreneurs, and you'll be encouraging the city as well as uh, the students at the university to really go out and take on their world and it would be upholding the mission and the principles of the university in that way. So we'd be showing uh, basically that we have the best university in the country because no other uh, university that we have been able to tell anyway uh, does anything like this so far. And I believe local charities would be so overwhelmed by how uh, eager our students were to like, help their community. Also. Again, the tweets and Facebook messages would be spread uh, from all over the country, spreading the good name of St. Edwards and getting more recognition of our tiny home on the hilltop. Um, but most of all, again, it'd be putting the, our motto into action for people to take on their world. Um, as you can see, um, our website is not yet launched. We are planning to do that sometime this summer. But if you go to our website at inspirevibe.com and you click uh, in your email, you uh, will be notified when we do launch in your city. So at this time, I would like to take any questions about the company or how it works.